Right, and how do you feel? Because I got the impression yesterday that that nobody, that no nobody has been to liaise with them to uh, have a welfare officer to sort of you know help Nothing, them along. No, no, since they sent that delegation to speak with them. I can give you the dates because I have it in my diary. I keep a personal diary at home and I have all the dates because I've noted them in my diary. Yeah. But right now, I can't give them to you. Yeah. But since that delegation with the minibus, as far as I'm aware, nobody has been to see them about anything. No. They have just told them it's going to be this way and that's right. it. Okay, well I was just told by the gentleman over there, the environmental consultant, that Nick clearly from Griffiths has been to see them Last week or something? I, I'm gonna. I'm, I will telephone them to find out no, if that is no, true. I'm not aware of that. I will have to ask my dad. And you weren't there, obviously. I wasn't there. Now they they won't go to see them while while Bobby's there. I can sort of under I can sort of under <laughs> understand that. It's quite a nice sound soundtrack or not to this conversation. Uh, but I can understand that because you know Bobby's got his dispute and and um, uh, and he's also, he's very upset about what they're doing with your mum and dad as well. I'm disgusted. Though. Well, they're in their 90s. My dad was second tactical air force in World War II, yeah. moving with the army across the continent. And most of the people who started in his squadron are no longer alive. In fact, most of them didn't even survive the war. Yeah, yeah. Most of them didn't come back. And I feel that they could show him just a little more respect, respect. And a little more kindness after he's risked so much for his yeah. country, that they could be a little more decent to him than they are being. Well, I'm sort of really glad that you've said this, even though it's bad, because I, I was on Facebook last night, having met your mum and dad first time yesterday, yeah. um, that's what struck me, and I know it gets Bobby really wound up, and I was wound up last night, and I put it all over Facebook, the way they're treating them is shameful, and I tweeted to the Welsh Government, to Welsh Assembly, and then this morning I thought, Okay, I might not know all the facts here, so I'm really glad I've met you. I appreciate you saying this. They've had no offer for any, no offer for any compensation. I know, I'm shocked. I they don't need a square inch of my mum and dad's garden in order to do this, so they're not offering them well, any compensation, and yet they're rendering their home totally valueless. I, I just find that horrible. shocking. I find that yes. shocking.